there's a brand new AI resource that is now available that I wanted to be sure to bring to your attention. So this is the OpenAI Academy. This is a free resource that's available to you and all you have to do is simply go in and sign in. When you do that, you'll be asked to simply put in an email account. You'll go through, create a simple account that'll ask you just a few questions, and then you'll get access to the full OpenAI Academy. The Academy is basically broken down into two different sections. You have the overall events. So this is a bunch of different events that they have coming up, as well as some that have already occurred. And then they also have content. So this is static information that's there and available for you to go through. Most of this is all just videos that explain different things. And that's a big, big part of this is that it has a huge spectrum of things that it covers. Everything from education, meaning K through 12, as well as higher education, as well as things like business, um, using AI for nonprofits, using AI for the elderly, all sorts of different topics are addressed. And so that's why this serves as a pretty good resource. They also have additional information and resources that they link to. So they have some external sources that you can click on. So this is a nice sort of put together area that can provide lots of information that can be very helpful. It also has a nice little search function. I tried looking for several different things and one of the big things I was interested in was certificates, but unfortunately there's no listing of anything dealing with certificates. So it doesn't offer that as far as part of the academy, at least not yet. So yes, this can serve as a great additional area that you can go to to get more information dealing with AI. And it's, it's really nice that they have live events as well as resources that you can just access at any time. So that's really beneficial. Now there's some, some caveats here, right? One is I don't understand why you have to create a new account if you already have an open AI account, but this is being structured as something completely different. I think it would have been much better if they simply integrated this with ChatGPT so you can access learning information, right? But, but that's all right. Now, the other thing we have to keep in mind is that although this is great and I'm, I fully support this because we see how AI is now starting to pay attention more and more to the field of education. Uh, there's been some recent things with open AI education and, and Claude education, anthropic education offerings that are tied directly with education at different levels, which is great. But we also have to take a step back here, right? In that we don't necessarily want all of our information, all of our education coming from the people that are giving the AI themselves, right? I'm sure there'll be some bias, some, some aspects of that that we need to sort of take a, 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 with a balanced approach because we should be getting our information from multiple different sources, from some academic sources, from different areas that beyond just getting it directly from the company, the business that's in a business to make money. So we have to make sure that we're, yes, using this good resource, but then also getting additional information from places like academic websites from journals showing us research from conferences from youtube channels like this one right so there's all sorts of great places to get information from but this is another good resource that i encourage you to go check out to see if there's beneficial things that you can take from this use at your educational institution or use for your students to help them to develop their ai literacy as well because there's lots of applications here at many different levels intro information as well as some more advanced information. So this can really serve to, to help you in, in different ways. So definitely recommend it, go check it out, and then tell me what you think, because I'm interested to, to learn, to see what you got. I'm, I'm gonna be attending one of those live events to see how, how well they offer information, but uh, I think this is a good resource, so definitely check it out. And remember, learning is for life.